family. So, me and my baby in Dollar Tree right now. Hey, baby. And I keep seeing on all of my groups, like, stackable planters. Look, y'all. I cleaned them out. Stackable plants at Dollar Tree. And let me show you. So, I'm in Dollar Tree. I know these not the ones y'all talking about, are they? They are. I don't even know if I could show you the size. This is my hand. These? I mean, you could maybe grow you some little, some little herbs or something. But I wouldn't even put strawberries in those. That's me. Um. So I know these, and in, in y'all pictures, they looking bigger. Like, I have some stackable planters that I love. So I was like, let me go to Dollar Tree and see if they got any. Um, but I'll just go ahead and show y'all what else is here. These are pretty, you know, they're thin, but they'll be cool for starting seeds and stuff before you transfer them. If you just need a bunch of little pots, um, you know, these I like because if you have stuff in the house and you don't want the water to spill, you can sit your pots in this. I'm actually going to get one of these. Um, and they got some little pots in here and stuff. But I came specifically for the stackable planters. And I know y'all if in line. Them not the ones. Y'all comment and tell me. Are them are those the ones? They also have citronella sticks. Which is supposed to be good for. Um, keeping bugs. Mosquitoes. And I think gnats and stuff too out of your area so that's cool and i'm gonna get one of these little frogs that look like he thinking <laughs> what he thinking about because there's always frogs in our yard it's cold now so we're not seeing as many but we love the little frogs and i want to put more decorations so they got some cute little so they got some cute little stuff but not them stackable planters um in my opinion, for what I'm trying to do, I would not get those tiny stackable planters. They got thermometers, gloves, you know, all kinds of little decorations and stuff. But I just wanted to ask y'all, are those the ones? Because they're not the ones for me, but maybe they are for you guys. And we'll see you later. Peace. Okay, family, so I'm back from Dollar Tree and I was disappointed in those planters. That was just the one that's close to me. So I definitely will stop by another one and just see what's up. See if they have some um, larger ones because I have been seeing a bunch of people posting about them. And I like to get things when they are available and on sale or cheap. So I will be looking out for those. Um, I do love the stackable planters that I got from Aldi, so I'll be looking for, out for those too. But that was like around August time when they had those on sale because according to them, um, you know, gardening season is almost over. But we know you can garden all year. But I want to show you guys something that I was super duper excited to find at the Dollar Tree. Check it out. All of these magazines were only a dollar. This one was interesting to me. I don't know if it will be that interesting to you guys, but it's like upcycling things. You can make a little, you know, cute stuff for the garden or for storage, which I thought was pretty cool. But these made me super excited too. I have a cast iron skillet that, um, I still need to learn to season actually, but um, that's something that I'm working on and I want to learn how to do more meals with the cast iron skillet. Um, it's supposed to be really good to cook with and it's something that you can cook with over an open flame, say like if you have no electricity and stuff. So I was really excited to get this cast iron cooking um, magazine. I got Clean It Naturally, uh, which is super exciting for me. I do make one cleaner that um, has vinegar and uh, alcohol and oregano 
and orange peels or lemon peels, whatever citrus peels I can find. But I'm excited to look through this and see if there are some other options of naturally cleaning. And then they had room fresheners, clothing care. I was just telling my husband the other day I want to find a natural stain remover. So maybe something like that will be in here. And they have sanitizers for cold and flu season. And then um, healthy meals in minutes. I am always cooking and I'm always cleaning the kitchen because there's five of us and we homeschool and stuff. And so my babies be hungry. I'm hungry. And I would love to be able to make some quicker meals. I'm also working on prepping things. So when it's time to cook, I don't have to, uh, you know, do as much prep. Um, but really what caught my eye too was this boost energy and immunity naturally. I'm always, always looking for ways to do that. I'm definitely going to be growing a lot more um, herbs and veggies to help me with that. But I was super excited about these books. They were only a dollar. Um, and I don't always want everything online, digital. Mm -hmm. I feel like nowadays it's like, get this book and you click on it and then it's like, it's only $3 for the ebook. And I'm like, ugh, like I want a physical book. What if the internet is down? Um, you know, I like to be able to see and read and bend the page down and take notes or put stars by things. And uh, so this really was a great value for me. So I'm going to say Dollar Tree was a win today. The stackable planners were tiny. Um, they were for like, put your seeds in there maybe, but these books really made the trip worth it for me. So check out your local Dollar Tree. You probably have bigger stackable planters. Hopefully you do in your area. If not, you may find something, um, like a resource, like what I found. And thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're happy and healthy and doing well. I'll see you soon.